B8 to B6. Killed. Okay. You're here. Okay. Let's uh, yeah, let's begin. Yeah. Okay. I need to get rid of this keyboard now. Disposable like everything else. Okay, so you're here. And um, just a minute. That means that We have already had questions to you on our uh, initial checkpoint. So you were brought here for more detailed interview, detailed questioning. So we need to be serious coming back home from traveling in capitalistic countries mm. we do have questions now you may have absorbed different philosophy different life views and uh, my job as a security border agent is to protect the regime, protect the state of things, the stability we have now. Yes, so uh, papers, where's your passport? Okay. Um so what am I supposed to do? You need to remove the cover. Uh, so apparently you think that security service should be of service to you. Well, it's not exactly the case. This is your passport. A red passport, blue face. Uh, it seems like you have, yes, uh, there's leftover shade of vacation you had in capitalistic country. Well, let's see. Uh, take off your... What's on your head? Mm, that's hair, okay. Glasses, hat. Yeah, remove your contacts. Mm, yet it, it appears to be you, unfortunately. Okay, let's see. Mm. So you've traveled quite a bit. You are, as we call, well traveled. few years back and the last trip you took hmm okay and uh, what is the reason of your coming back to motherland pleasure or business
Tady vidíte jo, ten celý projekt. OK. Military papers, please. Yes, military papers. I read as well. <laughs> Remanding of Red Army. And um, as you have your military ticket, that means probably or exactly this is the reason why are you being questioned additionally. Mm. Uh, you look way younger here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good, good. Very good. What is your rank? Yeah, I can feel some rank. Rank of capitalism. Mm. You did not serve. Such a shame. So now you're back and we will fix that. Private. <laughs> Great. So it says your size, size 10. Doesn't look like anymore. You're very young here. <laughs> What is this? Hmm, drafting. Drafting protocol. Okay. So, as soon as there is a draft, we shall see you in this dress. Great. Okay, we confirmed your persona. So now we need to check if there is something prohibited you might have brought into motherland. And uh, I have already seen the x-ray and uh, need to confirm our suspicions. But first I will need to confiscate this soy latte. Is it soy latte? I should try. Terrible. Terrible choice. What is this? Capitalistic stainless steel. Terrible choice. Soy latte. We all know that. Soldier of our beautiful country should drink some tea. Not some flavored. That's first item, first part of capitalistic culture that needs to be distinguished. Simple pleasure, simple drinks, tea, black coffee, vodka, simple. We don't need these add-ons, scoop of this, squirt of that. It makes weak man. Good times make weak men. And tough times make strong men. So one of the pillars of 
our religion is to make time as tough as, as it can be, as humanly possible to make strongest men emerge from the crowd, to eliminate the weakness. Of course, Russia is not for pussies. We know that. I don't need to remind you. Okay. Let me see. Let me see your bag. What did you bring? What did you bring to us? How were you planning to spoil our beautiful motherland? I see you have purchased this abroad as well. Some foreign craftsmanship, I can tell. It doesn't say made in USSR. It probably says made in China. Like every every good that comes from Western world. It's being produced in great Republic of Mao Zedong, People's Republic, not Capitalist's Republic. Okay, let's see. First item. Oh, this is democracy. Okay. Um, I will need to wash my hands from this profanity. <sighs> Democracy. Like you do not know who's gonna win the elections. This is what you call democracy. Uncertainty. Confusion. Anxiety. Strange, uncertain times. And we call it democratic choice. No choice, no problems. Okay, next. Oh, this is... This is independent press. Independent journalism. What were you going to do with this? in my land. Maybe it's as a concept, it sounds appealing, but realistically, independent press. Does your independent press sell advertisements? Oh, it's sifting through my fingers. It's vanishing already. It's vanishing. Oh no. Oh no, no independent press, no. We have several government approved printed resources. I need to wash my hands again. Red Star, Komsomolsk, Truth. Truth, yes, there's only one truth. Parliament. It's not a place for discussions. Like those Western politicians, they fight all the time. They fight and they say, no, I'm right, but you are wrong. And then people come over and take government buildings and they actually form unions and make even more people unhappy about this tiny rich people discussions in the so-called parliament. 
Why? Why? I do not understand. You guys, I guess you guys like to fight. You just like to fight. Unity. Peace. Unanimous decisions. Made by Supreme Leader. This is the best way to do. They know better. Politics is so dirty. Fighting. Corruption. When there's one person who does the corruption, at least you are certain that no one else is doing corruption. And now you brought democracy and free press. And you say blah blah blah, free press. What does it do to you? You express your opinion. Vox clamantis in deserto. No, you do not do not know any Latin. Because your capitalistic education system just smashed all the bright brains. They just dissolved all over the world. They live in Bali, Philippines, Dubai. They should stay in Netherlands to work for the good of the country. Okay. What is this? What else did you bring? Like more nonsense? More nonsense. Okay. What is this? You are already in trouble. You know that. It's okay. The party will fix all this crap that's been taught to you by your by our Western partners. Okay, what is this? That's independent judicial system. What is this? Judicial system. So, you think that a judge and a jury have a say in what the sentence would be. No, it's the prosecutor. He establishes the sentence. The balance should be maintained. And the judges doing their job. Otherwise they lose their job. This is how it goes. Being a judge for life, like in Western world? No. Well, yes, but your life would be very short if you make wrong decisions. So yeah, we cannot let any frivolous judicial system across the border. This is outrageously naive. Okay, I see the small pocket here, smallest pocket. Let me unzip. Ah, what is this? What is this? This is human rights. And uh, what do you do with them? It's an arbitrary concept anyway, human right. You have a right until someone stronger comes and takes this right away. And what do you do? Bring a knife to a gunfight? Mm, the guns. No. Gun trade is government's business. A citizen should not be given this freedom 
to possess a lethal weapon. Too much freedom, too much choice creates confusion. And so, clarity, certainness, predictability, known outcome. You know that you wake up tomorrow and your life would be exactly the same as it was yesterday. Isn't it comforting, reassuring to know that there's stability? But no, you have to go out in the world and explore those different ways, different styles of thinking and management. And, and in the end, it's all about the money, where you are, or where you were now, here at home, now we got you, you are belong with us. We will make sure that you will serve for the prosperity, for the great good, that you will support our Supreme Leader in his endeavors of conquering and establishing balance to counterweight this capitalistic society. No gegemony, no tyranny anymore, no dirty dollars. Okay. That's all you got. Good. Here there is hope for you. Okay, let me take some notes. So what what your fate is going to look like now? Well you have a choice. Either we let you go and tomorrow you go to military checkpoint and enlist and the second choice would be we take all of your stuff and uh, take you escort you comfortably to the enlisting station and you enlist there with your free will right now be a volunteer honorable honorable this is the choice and it's yours to make or we can continue discussing your ideas which you have as your new truth okay I'm checking the enlisting points where are you gonna go okay so time for you to decide to join today or to join tomorrow. You see, when the choice is one, it comforts you, makes you compliant. 
it does not tell you if you're wondering what should I do? Where should I be going? What should I be doing with my life? We give you the freedom of no worries about the future. And that's the most precious. We take care of everything for you. We take care of you. Okay, you made your choice. Great. Now, I will escort you to the next checkpoint. Since there is no more prohibited goods in your luggage. Okay. See you at the next checkpoint.